in this question, we have been given these three lines are parallel. This is parallel to this. RS is parallel to BD, which is parallel to PQ. We know the length of PC as 11, DP as 11, the length of BD as X, and that of RS is Y. We have uh, this as R, RD as 3 and RA as 3 again. And uh, we have to get this either. What is the possible values of X and Y respectively among the options given here? Now, we can start with any triangle. Look into this triangle. Talking about this triangle. Right? And consider this whole triangle. This whole, this whole triangle. Now, what's given here, these two lines are parallel. So we can use the... BPT theorem and from BPT what we can say that the ratio of AR to AD, the ratio of AR to AD, this should be what will be equal to AS to AB, that should be equal to RS. To BD. Let's obtain this ratio AR to AD. As you can see, this is uh, AR is 3 and AD will be 3 plus 3, that is 6. So we are going to get this as 3 by 6. And what do we know about this RS and BD? RS being given as Y and BD as X. So if you reduce it, what do we get? We get as 1 is to 2. So y is to x is 1 is to 2. Or you may say x is to y as 2 is to 1. Now, comparing the uh, options given here, x and y should be in the ratio of 2 is to 1. This is not in the ratio of 2 is to 1. This is on reducing, you'll get 6 is to 5. Similarly, this on reducing, you are getting 7 is to 3. This can this is in the reduced form, which is not 2 is to 1. But when you see the last option, 16, up, 16 upon 8, when reduce it is 2 is to 1. Therefore, this should be considered as the correct answer. 